Hey, yo, what's up, guys? TV into TV show. Hey, what's up, guys? TV into TV show is here, and today I'm bringing you my analysis about the Five Nights at Freddy's free teaser trailer from Scott Cofton. Now, uh, in this here video, I'm going to pretty much just watch the trailer with you guys, and I shall try to uh, like figure out some things like here example before the video even starts we can already see about a drawing a drawing of the golden freddy now golden freddy drawings aren't even seen in the first or the in the first or the second game barely we maybe one or two are seen but i don't remember anyway guys let's just begin Oh, and here is another fact. We can already see that here is the bunny before and here is bunny after her like so called mean side or also known as her bad side. Now let's just continue on. Wait, did you see that? Here's here's the puppet and he and right next to the puppet is we have our little balloon boy now balloon boy and the puppet because who knows uh, because Cuff the captain is usually like uh, always uh, puts this sort of hidden messages maybe this two shall be seen in the game again so let's just continue and here's another fact uh, you see this here text, he will come back. Now, when they say he, Scott Cofton, uh, we can uh, pursue about three characters. Is it either us, the night guard, the phone guy, or Scott Cofton himself, and the purple man. Now, as we, if we go right now in the Scott Cofton's uh, channel, uh, of our web page, uh, we can pretty much see he will come back but uh, it's written in purple while in here it's written in yellow and uh, by watching this we will think that it's golden freddy now no not golden freddy because in the his uh, site actually uh, site before all of the changes uh, we can see he will come back and it was written in purple so we can pursue it's pronounced for the purple man so he will come back purple man we will come back let's continue and here we can see the pizzeria from the first game which uh, pretty much explains or pretty much shows that we are going to be seeing more and more about uh, maybe we will be even in the pizzeria for the first game but maybe in an another section another part of the building let's continue He always does this uh, also prefers to the purple man because uh, the purple man um, well there are so many theories about just the purple man that he always comes back he always does come back in the first game in the second game even in those mini games even when the, the phone guy or Scott Cofton himself said that he's oh he always does now let's just continue on Did you see that? Look, the bunny's eyes. Now I should uh, retreat it like one or two seconds. And right now, just watch bunny's eye. And you will see. You just saw how it moves actually. The only bunny. And we know that bunny always in the first and in the second game, bunny is the character that always attack the first why because they're going alphabetically a b c d and etc now b because b as in bunny she always looks uh, she looked uh, at this place because she looked at the camera now uh, i believe in this here sec 
in the third game of the Five Nights at Freddy's. This, I believe the animatronics will try to help us, not to kill us. Plus, I believe so, because who knows? Let's continue. Now, we have a place for him. Now, I shall explain this uh, video after you see the next clip. Uh, actually, the next uh, few seconds uh, in this here little trailer. If you see it, then I shall explain what this actually means. Here, we have here some obviously a new animatronic because of its figure and because of the ears and the size of its and the shape of his head I will say that this is like some old uh, like golden bunny and uh, because uh, they say we have a place for him him prefers to the purple man maybe purple man is a is a shoved into this here uh, animatronic Oh man, it's really creepy. Am I right? And Five Nights at Freddy's. Wait. Before I show that, let's just go back a little. Wait, no. Wait. Come on. It's like little. Here. You see, we have our little soda. Da. We have our little fan. We have our little. Uh, stuffed toys that w I believe that we shall pretty much be buying them or releasing them uh, in the mini games if there are mini games and we can also see that there's actually a window between us and the hallway so maybe we can uh, see the animatronics running towards us also we can see pretty much that there's light maybe we can maneuver the light so we can like light up over there so we can see better and look at this uh, here's the new animatronic now here's the here's the bunny's case and behind him if I manage to activate it here here's the box from the uh, Scott Cuff, uh, Scott Cuffton's uh, own personal uh, website we can see the box which we see in his website site and see and look at this here's the animatronic which is freaking creepy as hell and we can see here like some sort of uh, freddy fazbear suit without the ears which pretty much is creepy and also the is here animatronic now i believe that this animatronic is the only animatronic that will attack us and try to kill us still um, who knows maybe the other animatronics shall pretty much we try to protect us or who knows and coming soon maybe it's in a few days because uh, I know maybe in a week maybe less than a week it shall be exactly 87 days now that refers to the bite of the 87 which is a whole another story which I shall explain in my next video so please guys stay tuned for more if you want to see more of Five Nights at Freddy's facts. See you guys all later. Bye.